This is Chatting with Chums. Welcome to this week's episode of the show where we talk about bulk shit. I know my hair. God damn it, Aatrox. <laughs> <laughs> I'm here with Aatrox, the asshole who always interrupts me. Uh, someone who has actually been on the show before, Toll of Ultimate Doom. I will be the new interrupting person as I know it. God no! damn it. You'll get kicked immediately. <laughs> on your first episode, you'll get kicked immediately. <laughs> And Kyler Nuva 135. Trust me, I, I've been worried about that. How dare you interrupt me? <laughs> you know what? This what? whole episode is going to be everyone interrupting everyone. That's right. God damn it. So, you, I you know what? No. You know what? 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 <laughs> I, can't, I can't go on with this now. <laughs> I'm going to choke on my own. So, I thought this was Iron Man 4 with Spider Man. It is it's pretty not much. Iron Man 4. I mean, the movie's going to make sure? a shit. I see Iron Man in the movie. Well, today we're about talking him. about Spider-Man Homecoming and uh, Iron Man, you know, because he's in it, which means the movie's going to make bank. And Batman as the vulture. Yeah, that's what? right. Michael Keaton's going to kick no, so much ass. I thought this was it's Christian Bale as Bulg. I'm sorry. I meant to say vulture. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. you fail. You fail at life. I'm sorry. You fail at making yet another Spider-Man reboot. Let's hope not. I really I'm want a good spider I want a good, perfect Spider-Man movie. Well, I mean... Exactly. Well, the last Stop one came out... Stop Spider-Man or I'm done with him. Well, I mean... If, we... if you want to see a perfect representation of Spider-Man, go back to the Japanese whatever the hell that was. You mean the Power Rangers okay. one? Yeah, sh sure. <laughs> no. Can we all agree the best Spider-Man probably was Spider-Man 2? That was probably... You mean the amazing Spider-Man 2? No! No! The one with Dr. Octopus. A.K.A. Alfred yeah. Molino, A.K.A. the guy that betrayed Indiana Jones in the, the very first movie of Raiders of the Lost Ark. Yes. There you go, we went actors again, as Gab said. What? It's a what? habit. I have a very encyclopedic uh, memory of what? actors. What? Yeah, what? Yeah, right about you. What? Shut what? up, Aatrox. What? What? I what? have the power what? to hang what? you up, what? so shut up. What? You want to talk about Marvel okay, guys, movies? Guys, this is guys, your chance. Guys, guys, guys. Tom Holland was a good Spider-Man. Just ask you guys from Civil War. Yes. Yes. I agree. Now we'll have to see if he can hold his own movie. Well. Yes. As long as he's with good actors, you know. At least, as long as he's not acting like Tobey Maguire. Hey, I miss Mary Jane. Or crying or his black emo. <laughs> this time he's actually in a real costume instead of a CGI one. Yes, that's good. I want that toy, Antonio. Yes. God damn it, what the hell is happening? Everyone just crying. <laughs> that's what Spider-Man is in 3! Oh uh, yeah, that's what Tobey Maguire was in uh, in the third one. No, no, uh, uh, there was also that dance scene. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. Oh. No, never again. Don't mention that. It will get cut out and I want never... to mention it. I want to mention it. No! No! If you You're mention fine. it one more time, I'm hanging you up. <laughs> I have the power to do that, Aatrox. Yeah. So we have Spider-Man Homecoming, and then we have Guardians of the Galaxy as well this year. Yes. yes. Anyone what? notice Baby Groot? Yeah. No. Uh, God. I thought that was Groot too. Oh, it's Baby Groot. I don't care. That thing is going to sell I, I so can't. many toys, man. I can't. It's going to be crazy. <laughs> I'm crazy. just going to tell you, Groot is overrated. I can agree with that a little bit. From one trailer to the toys. But I am excited to see what they do with Baby Groot some, for some reason. Yep. Yeah. He's going to be killing everybody and yelling. I wonder if Vin Diesel's still playing him. I think he is. That'd be kind of funny. <laughs> they high pitched his voice, I think. Yeah. I could be wrong. How's it even possible to high pitch Vin Diesel's voice when his voice is already like super, super low? So, won't it like, come out as like a normal voice? They, they have someone come in and kick his balls during the voice acting. Stuff. Ah, oh so James Gunn comes in and kicks Vin Diesel <laughs> in the balls when you're recording. That makes sense. Don't yes, worry, I'm a professional. <laughs> I'm a professional pole kicker. Uh, Let's hope he doesn't pull an age of Ultron on us. Oh, God, no. No, he's a much better director than Josh Whedon. Although, I, I have mean, to say that the Russo I mean, brothers Whedon are Whedon did better. direct Alien 4. <laughs> he didn't direct it, though. He uh, wrote it. Well, it doesn't so, matter. It's still, it's still in it. bullshit writing, though. Iron <laughs> Man's going after Zendaya. Whoa! Whoa! I don't understand all those rumors and those bullshit. Like, who cares who this character is, actor is or whatever? Thank you! Like, just all go... You really want to be paying attention to the story. Like, no one's freaking out over the fact that Michael Keaton is playing a bad guy in a Marvel movie. That's fucking badass. Hopefully they don't kill him, though. That's my biggest fear right now. Only the villains kill themselves. Yeah, most yeah. of the time. But you know what villain isn't gone? Loki. 
and Winter Soldier. He, well, Bucky. Yeah. Well, Bucky's still this. I mean, he's still a good guy. We just still brainwash. Yeah. Well, not exactly brainwash anymore. He's just trying to recollect himself yeah. as the story goes because it's civil war. I'm really the thing I'm looking forward to most of all about about all villains is just Josh Brolin as Thanos. Yeah. Oh, that was a very the awesome. dude is a great <laughs> actor, and I don't think I've se- I don't think I've seen him play many villain roles, but I know he can play a badass villain or a character. He's gonna do something. You just have to wait for it. Well, I mean, he's gonna. No, I'm tired of waiting. Well, don't worry. Kyle, we don't have to, have wait. to wait. One How more year, Kyle. How many movies have he appeared in for five seconds? That's not true. Alex. That's impossible. Sir Tyler, you know it'd be true. Yeah, you're right. Hey, Kyler. Kyler, please be a good boy and wait patiently. How about no, Kyler, yes, you only have to wait years. until next. I've been waiting ten years. You have to wait God, one more year, Kyler. We're gonna wait for Thanos for another fifteen years. No, one more year and probably five months. Yes. No. I've well, already think... wait, waited too long for Spider-Man to be in the Marvel movie, and now he's in the Disney comedy with Casey undercover. And no, they have you're ruining my Spider-Man. <laughs> you guys are made for each other, the way. You guys are seriously made for each other. <laughs> this is the inter- this is the interrupting episode. That's what this is all about. The interrupting episode. With Spider-Man, Spider-Man Three is basically a huge interruption. Ain't that the truth? <laughs> All that dancing, too. Ooh. Oh, God, no. <laughs> That's the end of the recording. That's it. I'm done. If there's one more mention of Emo McGuire Spider-Man dancing, I'm cutting this recording off. Emo McGuire Spider-Man dancing. God damn it, Tyler. <laughs> That's it. The end. <laughs> I'm wrapping, it. Just, just I'm wrapping this shit up now. Okay, <laughs> thank you for watching <laughs> Chatting with Chums. This is Shadow 1. I'm here with Toe of Ultimate Doom, Aatrox, and Kylie Number 135. We've been talking about Spider-Man, and this is... And emo, emo McGuire Spider-Man dancing. And Kyler was going to close out with that. <laughs> with God damn it. Balls. All right. Thank you for watching. We'll be seeing you next time.